Okay, so this short video is going to show you how to take uh, a YouTube video and embed it inside of your live text document, specifically your live text portfolio that you use for your uh, undergraduate CPED 2023 course. Um, what you're going to do is you're going to start by logging into live text. Here you can see I'm inside of live text and you can see that I'm in my portfolio. And what you're going to do is you're going to go over here to the place where it says, uh, you know, one of the pages inside of your portfolio. I'm going to go ahead and uh, choose facilitate and inspire student learning and creativity, which happens to have this picture uh, of uh, a couple of trees. Uh, basically the picture here is a placeholder. Um, that is actually where I want the YouTube video to go. So we're going to go up here to the top right uh, into the section editor and click on edit. And I've already gone through and selected the video that I want. And here you can see inside the area this picture is here. Um, it basically holds the space. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete the picture. And a lot of times what I tell students to do is to uh, enter in some text that will allow them to place the video exactly where they would like it to go. Uh, in this case, I'm just putting in uh, XXX. Uh, when we go up here to click on source, you're going to see that somewhere in all of this code, which represents what we just saw, you're going to see that there is an XXX. And that is actually where we want to put the YouTube video code that you get from the YouTube website. So let's go to the YouTube website. I've already got it open here, and there's a video here that, uh, that uh, has been created. It is set to public, which is good. That means uh, someone looking at your uh, live text portfolio will be able to see the YouTube video content because it is set to public. And I'm going to click on the Share button. You notice it, it indicates that it will share or embed the video. Normally, when you share a video, you merely just click on the Share button and grab the URL of the Uniform Resource Locator, the website address of the uh, YouTube video. But in this case, we really want to embed the YouTube video, not just link to it. So we're going to click on the word embed here. And here you can see it already selects some uh, code here that we want to use. And you can customize that code with uh, uh, some point and click uh, variability here. Um, I always tell people to use the old embed code because it seems like it works better with live text uh, currently. And you can select the different uh, sizes of the window and you can even customize the size. For the most part, I tell people to use or choose the smallest one that's available. Go ahead and right click on the code and click copy. And then we're going to go back over to live text. Here's our XXX and we're just going to simply replace that content there by right clicking and pasting the content in there. Here you can see this is the reason why we copy and paste it in because it's so much easier to do than to try and type it all by hand. I'm going to click back on the source button. That's going to allow us to go through and see that we have the flash content available there. We can scroll down. We don't see the video yet. We just simply see a flash placeholder for the content. I'm going to click on save and finish for this particular section. And then when we come out of it, we're going to see that there's the YouTube video. It's ready to go. And we can click on play and it'll go through and actually start playing the content. So that's how you go through and embed a YouTube video into your live text document or any other live text document um, that you might be using. Hope that helps.